Charisma. Charisma is a difficult concept to put into words. When someone is charismatic, they are magnetic. They are impressive, and we instantly want to be liked by them. These people are usually natural leaders, and they are people that can hold our attention. Many celebrities have natural charisma, but some have it in even greater quantities than others. Great examples include Dwayne the Rock Johnson, Michelle Obama, Oprah, Will Smith. These are people you can just watch and watch. So where does this come from? According to studies, this essentially boils down to passion once again, and to congruence in what they say and what they appear to do. In particular, this means that they talk with their whole bodies and that their faces are animated too. One piece of research found that people who gesticulate more were more likely to be rated by third parties as charismatic. The reason given is that when someone gesticulates, they talk with their whole body. Once again, this tells us the importance of body language. The result is that they appear to really believe what they're saying, and that tells us that it's worth paying attention to. So, should you try and force more gesticulations? Thinking about where your hands are as you talk certainly won't do any harm. But more important is to make sure that you really do care about what you're saying and that you really are passionate about the topic. This is far better than trying to fake your passion. Showing more emotion of any kind is actually generally an important thing if you want to be charismatic. This is also important when it comes to storytelling. Watch someone like Will Smith tell a story in an interview, and you'll notice that they do it with a whole lot of emotion, that they leave big pauses, that they impersonate people, and that they set the scene. Not only does this require incredible confidence, because there is a risk of setting yourself up for a fall, of building a story up too much, and then not delivering with a punchline. But it also once again demonstrates more emotion. When you set the scene of your story and bring it to life, other people will be able to feel the emotions you felt at that time. Your gesticulations and facial expressions help with this, because of what are known as mirror neurons, which are the neurons that fire in reaction to seeing the expressions of other people. This makes us feel as the other person is feeling. So practice telling stories with your whole body and painting the picture for the audience. Learn that you don't need to get to the end of the story right away and have the confidence to share your emotions. You'll be far more engaging and charismatic as a result, as well as much more relatable. Persuasion. Persuasion and charisma are very similar concepts, but with one more interesting element added in, an understanding of others and of the people you are talking to. The key is to recognize that human beings are not driven by logic. We do not buy, subscribe, or sign up when it makes logical sense. Instead, we do all those things when we feel emotionally driven to do so. And this is why charisma and persuasion are so closely linked. Once again, it is about being able to convey emotion and getting people to understand the point you're making. In doing this, you are going to tap into a value proposition, an emotional hook. In other words, if you are trying to sell, you don't sell a thing, but instead, you sell a dream. You don't sell a gaming console, you sell a promise of futuristic technology enabling adventures and exploration. You don't sell a car, you sell status, comfort, safety, and freedom. You don't promote a political party, you promote a vision for how you can make the world a better place. When you can tap into the emotion behind your message, and when you can get that to relate to the things that the person you are speaking to wants, then you can drive any behavior you wish. Action Points Learn to value yourself and to portray yourself as high status. Convey that you are high status without making others feel lower. Charisma comes from gesticulations. Tell stories that set the scene and involve emotion. Find the value proposition to persuade people on any topic. For more free educational content, visit learnforfree.biz. Content produced and distributed by AllSuperInfo.